Hello, and thanks for viewing this quick tutorial on launching your OpenVPN Access Server. Our focus will be specifically on installing Access Server on a Linux server. For the next few minutes, we will just be focusing on the Ubuntu distribution. Uh, to begin, you need to log into your console and have root privileges available using a tool such as PuTTY or any SSH tool. I'm on a Mac here, so I'll be using a terminal, and I'm already logged in and have root. Next, we're going to install the OpenVPN Access Server. We recommend using the official OpenVPN Access Server repository, which can be found on our website under Business VPN and Software Packages. So if I scroll down, I'll see my distribution, Ubuntu. I just need to click on it. And Ubuntu 18 is up. I just need to copy these commands and then paste them into my terminal. We have a bundled package available in the app. The commands from the website will add the repository or system and install both the Access Server package itself as well as the client. To launch these commands, you just need to hit Enter. You can see that this already installed CA certificates, net tools, and wget right up here. Now you have added your Access Server to your apt config with this line. Next, we just need to run apt update and then do the actual install. Hit enter. Starting with version 2.75, the install configures Access Server with default options. After it completes, it displays the necessary information for you to reconfigure it manually. It also lists the URLs of your admin UI and client UI, which I just received on my terminal right here. So we'll make a note of our admin UI. That's the first place we're going to want to go. And then all we need to do to get into that is to set a password, and we can use the Bootstrap OpenVPN user for that. And the command is password OpenVPN. I'll set a quick password. And now if I open a new tab here, I should be able to go to our brand new server. We're always going to get that SSL warning because it's a self-signed certificate that ships with Access Server. However, it's very easy to configure your own SSL setup, your own web SSL setup. I'll enter that using the OpenVPN user and the password I just created and click Agree to agree to the end user license agreement. And there it is. We're in our admin UI of our new Access Server. It's version 2.75 and the server is currently on. Thank you for joining me on this tutorial on installing Access Server.